Hey guys, what's up? JT here, and it's time for TV Turn Up. Okay, so I watched Limitless. It was really, really good. I don't know if you guys have seen the movie, uh, came out in 2011, it's really good. But the TV show picks up where the movie left off. The opening scene started off with a bang. There was, if you haven't seen the movie, that's fine. Because the good thing about how the TV show is set up is it gives you a narrative of what's going on. It allows our star, played by Jake McDormand, to use the entire, the entire capacity of his brain by taking this pill. And when I say use the entire capacity of his brain, I mean not only as far as logic and um, and book smarts, but also memories and probability. One of the things that I liked the most about it was we're able to see his brains planning and plotting. We're able to see when he takes the pill, when we see things through his eyes, the things are brighter, uh, things are more detailed. We can see him deciding, if I go this way, this is what's gonna happen. If I go this way, this is what's gonna happen because that's there and that's there and this is there and this isn't here. It's just, it's so intricate. I think that's gonna be the thing that hooks people onto this show. Only thing I'm worried about is if this is gonna be a typical case of the week show, because that can get a little bit repetitive if there is no underlying story. So, I'm excited about it. It could be really good, could be really bad. I'm giving it four out of five teacups because there was a lot of talking that could have been more action in the premiere. Make sure you guys check out Limitless Tuesdays at 10 p.m. on CBS. And the other Tuesday show I watched, which I really, really enjoyed, is Scream Queens. It is a new show from the creators of American Horror Story and Glee. Uh, Scream Queen, it's your good old-fashioned mean girl show, but not like Lindsay Lohan Mean Girls, but more like Jawbreaker and Heather's Mean Girls. Emma Roberts, Jamie Lee Curtis, Leah Michelle, Kiki Palmer. About a female sorority on this campus that only takes in these certain kind of girls, rich, uppity, mean girls. And basically the dean tells them that you can't keep treating everyone on this campus like shit, so now you have to accept everybody. So they accept this band of misfits and things just spiral downhill from there. Um, it's very campy and can be a little creepy. But um, and some people might think that it's too graphic or think that it's too mean, but I thought it was hilarious. Only, I'm saying it's really, really good, but I only gave it three and a half out of five teacups, and this is why. It's just some of the acting is really, 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 really bad. But if you're into your classic Mean Girls films, if you're into campy horror, like Rocky Horror style campy horror, then you should definitely watch this show. Make sure you check it out Tuesdays at 8 p.m. on Fox. Um, please make sure that you subscribe to my channel because I post a couple of videos every week. The link to watch those are right here. You probably can't see it if you're on a mobile device because your annotations don't work. Uh, if that's the case, then click on the link in the description box below. And to see any of my previous videos, maybe we talk about Taja Call or my favorite Nickelodeon show, then keep commenting click on the pink box. And remember, a thumbs up means you like me, and a subscribe means you love me. And I love you too. <laughs>